guys, Jill here. I have a small haul to show you. I have been a bit absent here, sorry about that. As earlier, I've been trying to level out my allergies and um, certain times of the day it's good so I got up really early to make this video. So, let me just show you the things that I've got. And it's not a lot, but I'm happy with the things I found. First look at this. It is so cute. Um, it's had some little neon bones in it, but obviously you know it's Hello Kitty um, for Halloween. And when I got this at Joann's, it was $3.99. I then saw them at Michael's for $3.49. So kind of keep your eye out on that. Plus, at Michael's this week, everything with the coupon is 50% off. Um, let's see. When I was at Joann's, they had a whole bunch of their, what do they call these? Well, they're just brads. They're star brads. And they were 50 cents. So I figured if nothing else, I can modify those some. Let's see. Okay. So this is from TJ Maxx. These were $1.49. And I love using rhinestone brads kind of to shove in things. And actually, I worked on a project in... I've really whittled down my collection. They only had one of these, so I got them. They also had a whole bunch of punches. And this one I really liked. And I liked it as was. And then I came home and I punched it. And look how cool that punch is. And then on top of that, you end up with all the little bits and pieces. And I have a book on flower making and the lady uses the pears to make a I think it's a pansy so I'm gonna give that one a try um, now the rest of this I got at Michaels so I'll first show you the Jolie's Boutique stickers and these little gourds and pumpkins are adorable and of course they have a bat on them, so I had to get them. But the swirl, too. I just love that. I also picked up, let's see if these have a name. Dimensional stickers. Yeah, I guess that's their name. Skull cameos. <laughs> it's like, wow, great name. So, you guys know me and Halloween. I love Halloween. And then some skull cameos. I really got a kick out of these, so I picked those up. The week I got these... The rubber stamps were 40% off. But one thing is that at both of the Michaels I went to, I was kind of irritated because things on end caps were not discounted. So really keep an eye on that at the cash register because they ended up marking them down for me because they fit into the ad. The ad said 40% off rubber stamps and it included cling, clear, all of it. And it, the only thing that it excluded was Martha Stewart stamps. But um, I just thought that was silly. And I've already taken this one out of the package. But this was the Seven Gypsies set. And I really like things with swirls that you can fit words into. And this one would work either way. And I think it was like $2.40 when I was after the 40% off. Same with these. I had some really cool ones this year. This one is like a twall. And I don't think that they named these. Oh, they did. Twal. <laughs> um, but if you notice, there's like a grave site. They're trick-or-treating. And I just thought this was really, really cool. Here's the skulls and a spider web. Um, I just really, really like that one. And then, of course, me and bats and swirls. So there you go. <laughs> um, and this one... Damask bat. So again, this one was like two forty, and then they had the clear stamps, and there was a few cute ones, but this one, just that owl, I thought was really adorable. I mean, the bat's cute, but that owl was really adorable. And this one's just called owl, and same price range. Um, oh, then I picked up some thermal web with one of my coupons because I always need this stuff. And then lastly, I was really excited to see this. I have the big Martha Stewart scoreboard, and 
I love it. I absolutely love it. But I know that Scorpaw has the Scorpaw Mini. And I've always wondered why Martha Stewart never came out with one. Well, she did. And with the 40% off. And this week, the... 50% off coupon won't work on it because Martha Stewart Crafts is 25% off. But still, I think it was like 10, 10, 50. And I scored this ad that I got in the mail. Um, and it scored really nicely. And this is a thick, glossy flyer. So, um, and I actually like the scoring tool. It attaches up top here and it actually hooks on. So this would be really great for travel, but it's also really great for storing on my desk instead of that big 12 by 12, which I think is more like 13 by 13. And then on the back of it, I've heard not so good things about this, but it's a really good guide, I think, if you're making envelopes. It's a um, cute little envelope maker. So, again, in a pinch, I'm sure this makes just fine envelopes. And if the people you're giving your cards to don't appreciate handmade envelopes, well, then you probably shouldn't be giving them cards either. So, there's all of my haul. Again, nothing huge, but I've put myself on a budget trying to use up the things I have. I know a lot of people are lately, so... I had to pick up just a few things here and there. Oh, and then this punch, sorry, I meant to mention a TJ Maxx, $3.99. So, I, again, I really limited myself. They had a bunch of others, and that's the only one I ended up getting. So, there you have it. There's my haul for, I guess, the last month-ish, and, um... My mom had got this for me. So, I'm done for September. So, there you go. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.